Hello, hello and welcome boys and girls. We'll have another Save Premier League game and now it's a Save uh, World Cup qualifiers where Forever Young is playing against one last try and Forever Young is leading with a one victory in a PO2 PO, PO2 series. PO3. Sorry, PO3 series. You must win twice. And I am in. So it was not my problem. It's someone some tricky guy had wrong modes. Ah, let's hope for the best. It's a 7 C's map we're in. We will have no remaps. They both were taken on the previous map. Both teams decided to remap and now we'll have a nice smooth game from the start to the very late game within GDRs and nukes. But this is the best thing. In a safe game to nuke entire planet. We all want to finish this suffering. So, uh, I remind you that Dido is super cool now uh, with the new Magnus update. She's truly really shine. And even without that trade road, that, that nerf is super, super hit her hard. And I hate it. But somehow people are cool with that. Hey, uh, she still can, can make a, a good game. I don't think that uh, she's better than. Uh, Age of Empire wiki, uh, surely she's not, but maybe somehow she can beat Age of Steam Victoria. Uh, but that is uh, is way better now with the, with the Magnus new Magnus. So we'll keep an eye on her. Who's playing Taito, by the way? Just Demon is playing Taito. He's from the very young team, right? Uh, it's a Jack. Jack playing. Uh, uh, Hungary, uh, Kenny West. I don't. I can. I don't know who this is. Um, but by the way, anyway, he's playing uh, America, and Lan is playing uh, Vietnam for another team for a one last try. Puri is playing Khmer, who was buffed with a cultural bomb on his shrines once again. I can't find him. Maybe here. Ah, uh, it's Merrick. Oh, yeah, that's him. Uh, Daniel is playing Korea here to the north. Uh, JJJ is playing uh, Vicky. Age of Steam and Age of Empires Vicky for Sandra games. Oof. Okay. Surely be tough. Uh, somehow Sandra game is not. Oh, it's good. We're good. Turn two. No lags, no disconnects. Cheers for that. Cheers for that, so go, go, go. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope we have an amazing game here. So, uh, let's start with a, uh, a Rip the Jacker. Uh, it's a London. Rip the Jacker. You know, wasn't Rip the Jacker a London serial, ki serial killer? I believe he was. Anyway, it's 3-1 base, classical with the mod, with a 3-1 fish and a 3-2 bananas, and a 1-3 tile, but no more no other Good tiles, okay, one three, one three, one three. Good amount of production, good amount of food. An amazing city, amazing first city for Age of Steam, uh, Victoria. And no continents, please, unfortunately, that's disappointing. But still, I really like naval saves with the yellow hills. They make a lot of food from the sea tiles, a lot of production from the yellow hills. That's way better than the green hills. And he does have a lot of space and a a uh, secret southern sea when he can uh, fit some cities. So it's about to be a great game for him. Unfortunately, I have no uh, other continents. Maybe this one red. Let's check positioning for uh, this team. Oh, well, maybe he somehow can trade with Khmer. Uh, yeah, I believe he can. Like, it's, it's less than a 30 tiles, definitely. So in late game they can trade with Khmer, and if Khmer go uh, fit the world, then he definitely go for that. Uh, it'll be a great trade between them. Um, let's back to positioning. Uh, another England can trade with Khmer, and Korea can trade with anyone he'd like to, or maybe he can just rush something, uh, like watch a push. Uh, Taito can settle. 
uh, concerning a lot of cities, uh, the creator think that he is on a on his personal scene. <coughs> mm. On his personal scene, that no offensive actions against Taito. But the problem is that if you want to settle south, that means Viki in the other game can nuke, uh, can nuke Taito. Uh, that's a big problem. Or maybe he can out sim uh, Viki somehow in this position, but I'm not sure. Let's check positioning. He can trade with a uh, with America. That's great. America can trade with uh, Vietnam through those mountains. Maybe later they will use a uh, tunnel. And Buddha can trade with Vietnam as well. So Vietnam will be boosted at least from Hungary. Hungary is great see, for boosting someone with the trade routes. A lot of um, usually usually players build a lot of trade routes. I remember the Hungarian uh faith build where you was building well you're supposed to build um all these sites in the first district and and you had about negative about zero gold or even less <laughs> because you spam only all the side districts in your first seven cities uh and you opens with the seven cities it was terrible <laughs> it was terrible terrible days and terrible build uh oh, you, well you was always dead in the mid game so <laughs> those days have passed and now everyone plays as a playing as a uh gold making hungry with a with an influence on the city states uh by the way talking about city states we might take a look at them the antenari would do the north no one will ever find it uh Mahenjadara to the south same story i try in the middle and maybe Maybe England can use it. I take what good city get extra. Uh, I believe it's ten percent of production converted into culture. Uh, okay, yellow ones at Jerusalem. I uh, think it can be killed by England if he settles here. Uh, maybe there is another city state. No, it looks like there's no Levanta and uh, Yerevan. Yerevan right here. Between Korea and the niches. There might be a fight for a yearly one. Oof. Uh, then uh, two yellow ones, Hansa and Khakia. Khakia right next to America, but it's in the tundra, so it probably will survive. Two brown ones, Johannesburg to the south and Singapore. Our uh, way far to the north, behind the Arctic Circle. And Lahore. The red one, once again in Tundra and the Midland, the only blue city state that might decide the fate of the game is located on a on a shore. But there is no naval saves around it. Maybe Hungary will try to push it somehow. But anyway, Hungary might sue Midla so hard that no one can ever uh, take it away from him. Oh, Hungary is located right next to. Um, Age of Steam Victoria. We might see some uh, mid game black army activities or maybe even Mitla uh, Swordsman push. I believe that is what's gonna happen. That's really unfortunate. City state for England and really good one for Hungary. And he's about to find the city state. Right? No! Ah, yes, yes. We'll check it. Maybe he already knew about it. We already know about it. Uh, we can check right now. Yeah, well, he's aware that there's a blue city state, and he definitely would like to check it. But there is a hut, and I think it, it's better to go for a hut. So let's talk about starting position. We were talking about England, and already it's turn 10, and already Sandra settling south. Ooh, a bit here. I think it's weird. Maybe, maybe it's hill. Hard to say. Oh, he's blocking. Oh, what a perfect, perfect, perfect timing. He's blocking uh, Vietnam Scout from his domain. That's great. This is perfect. This is perfect. One, two, three. And he can settle this tile if he'd like to. I believe he'd do. I believe, I believe he, he'd like to settle that. Maybe a bit later. And he can open with the three cities. 
right away, three settlers, right away, boom, 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 four cities opening. Uh, super popular thing right now. Um, Tang Long. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Uh, we should uh, stick with the team. So, JJJ, another England with a 2 2 pace, uh, 3 1 bananas, unfortunately, 2 3 horses. Yeah, English England opens with horses. Uh, 2 3 horses, 1 3 trial, and 3 1 banana, or maybe 2 2 2 2 2 3. So, extra production here for England, that's great. He's moving south, he's about to settle right next to Mount Everest with a Good extra face of free pantheon. Look at this. Look at this amount of faith. Um, unfortunately, he can't go with the mentality even with this amount of extra faith. It's not having a plate. Ooh, he'll settle this tile. He'll settle this tile. Ah, oh, sweet, sweet, sweet. Really strong start. Maybe he can carry because well, he need this. He need this extra tempo. Uh, otherwise, Hungary will trample him. Uh, a lot of fresh water, maybe he won't settle there. It's really hard to settle here. Well, it's a bit risky to settle here because of scout. Uh, I passed. The hut. Moved away from the hut. Okay. Uh, who's next? Korea here. 3 1 base. Mm, not the best of ones, but 1, 2, 3, 4 actually plus. Plus four possible so one, say one. Uh, second city two to base with a number, which is not good. I probably expecting he expect to work on these honey tiles with a one three tiles available. And is it a gypsum? Yeah, it's a gypsum settle. Mm, he should buy out, right? He should buy out this one, or he just, or maybe he can just work one three because of. Coastal city, you can't grow tile, and I guess it's fine to go for one three. And a save on here with a plus three. It's still good. It's still good. Hungary is lurking around. He's aware that there's Hungary in Hungarian scatter. Maybe this one will go back, or maybe they will just. Yep. He's going back, and no scout needed. Uh, who's next? Hungary, Hungary, Hungary. Come here. The last one is Khmer oh, for a one last ride. It's a 3 1 pace for Anchor Tom to 2 1 3 and then more stones. Nice, a good holy side with a plus 5 and no pantheon yet, so it will be plus 6 even. Oh, that's great. Volcan, of course, is about to erupt and it will destroy both of these holy sites. That's unfortunate. But there's nothing much you can do about this. Two cities for now, so you can build, so you can finish shrines. Okay, good one. Uh, now let's talk about uh, Forever Young team, starting with Hungary, which is on the edge. He can bully England and Korea, and he probably do this. Uh, usually Jack is playing quite uh, a wide empire here, uh, like uh, six city opening. Maybe, maybe he will he'll play a bit less. Uh, maybe like three, four cities with a ancestral hall, and then he expands if he can. Probably he can. There's a lot of rivers for him. Not quite unusual for this map. Well, this map has a lot of rivers, but look at this here. Boom! Another one here. Another one here to the south. He can settle like seven or even even ten cities on these rivers. Mm, maybe maybe not ten because there's Korea and England. So, uh, he's starting with a 3-1 base and 1-3 to 2 tile and a 3-1 over here. I'd like to pr I'd like to have extra tile, but maybe it's not necessary. Uh, Tabersen with a 5 uh, opens with a trade road. Okay, that's good. Korea already uh, found his newly founded city with a warrior. Mm. And everyone needs extra gold to buy slingers or to build some protection units. It's in the CPL. Uh, okay, just uh, just a moment. Uh, Thalong, Vietnam. Starts with a 3-1 base. Oh, extra culture. That's sweet. Extra culture to 2-1-3. And a volcano right in the middle, maybe he's not happy about that. 
Um, the biggest problem for me playing as Vietnam is to build that triangle. So you can place a city here and build triangles somewhere around this territory so you can fit some campuses. I don't really think it's a good idea to build around uh, active volcano because all jungles will be lost in time. Uh, third settler is about to pop up and a builder here. Ooh, he's aiming for bananas, I believe. No, it's bronze working. Um, is it to improve iron? I guess to... Okay, I, I don't know why it's builder. I just don't know. But city is good, the good plantations around it. And here you can settle a few cities to the south easily. Uh, he can even attack England with a Tom. It's not Tom Race, but this is Elephant. Uh, I can't remember the, the, their name. Uh, how they called. Uh, anyway, yeah, he's about to settle here, right? Or maybe it's non fresh. It can also be a non fresh. And the last one is America here with a 3 1 base, 3 2 banana, 1 3 silk. It's an epic start of the Yellow Hills and a good campus. Double campuses is already replacing. Once again, Volcanoes is about to erupt. Uh, a lot of. Like, it's, it's about to finish. Damn, that's great. And a Pantanal. Oh, I said it's right next to a Pantanal. He can buy out one tile. Pantanal's a bit better. Now it gives you extra production, so it's not that useless tile. It doesn't really need that. Science because of double campuses like what plus two and plus four probably can be a plus three if he sacrifices ships for a for another districts and it does looks like we'll have a common plaza over here with a double uh, commercial house with a plus three four five right uh, two three four five yeah plus five here and plus five here that's a good one it's a it's a lot of science for second golden age for America. Not that many place, not that much place to settle here. He has uh, tidy settling. Taught him. Mm. He's not very happy about that. So there will be a two cities, like on this horse and on on the corn. Uh, it's maize on maize, on the three, and maybe one city on this honey tile. Mm, he's going for monuments. Monuments. He's going for monuments. So he's rushing, rushing uh, political philosophy. Maybe he's he, he's going to rush uh, the hall, but well, he surely should do it. Uh, not that many jobs. Like one, two, three, and it's a stone. Maybe you don't you don't really like. I don't really like the chop stone. I have to open extra tech here, uh, but still. One, two, three, four, maybe even five at the third trade is a bit too expensive. Not that many, not that many jobs. So we won't see the settler spawn. And by the way, by the way, he probably will go here where fast and ship building. We can sail across the sea. And as I remember, builders has loss for movement. It was nerfed, then it was not nerfed again. But trade out is still forbidden for Taito. Okay, okay. Void Chen. That's a plus five industrial. No need to chop. Yeah, but uh, you can't have industrial by turn four, but by turn 30. You're right about industrials. That's a really good one. But uh, tempo is better. So it's one, two, it's a three settlers. With the with Magnus chops plus. Ancestral Hall is extra three settlers with a single builder. So, you know, <laughs> who cares about industrials if you can have uh, three extra cities? Just getting so. Oh, okay, with the stone circles, yeah. Yeah, definitely. If you get uh, stone circles, it's okay. If you get, if you can get stone circles, it's okay to keep the stones. Yes, you're right. You're right about that. Um, solid rollovers. Okay, uh, I wanna check the pinks. So I have yellow pinks with everyone. Yeah, connection here. But I think it's my connection because... 
yellow everywhere. That's sad, that's sad. It's getting it's getting worse with each month. It started like when like this winter. It started this winter. I had perfect connection before it and now it's super bad. Like it's good for using internet, but not for gaming, I guess. That's disappointing. Uh, Korea has three cities already and three savings and he protects it. But protects it. Alright, I said it correctly. And the um, scout just moved away. Another scout moved away. England is about to lose its improved horse. It has one slinger, but there's another scout from the north. He should be aware because Korea most likely uh, told him that there's a scout uh, moving south. Maybe he's not aware. He can place a really good city over there, over there. Lot 3 campus, like a 4 city. Yeah, he's about to do so. And Alex are quite good uh, resource. It's uh, what, 2 to 3? It's not that bad tile at all. Oh, and Hungary settling toward England. Oh. Uh, will it be like a horse rush? Horseman rush. It probably shouldn't be a horseman rush because Korea have a lot of science and uh, you should be aware that Hwacha push is an option. It's, a lo it's always an option for Korea. Okay, I can give you a link very fast. Uh, it's in a CPL. Oh, it's oh, okay. I guess it's uh, the link is closed. You have to be, uh, you have to have a CWC track, I guess, or something, to see to be able to see it. Or maybe uh, you can try. You can try. Um, what's it called? CPO uh, site or CWC site. There should be a link under my stream. If you can find something there, I just don't know where to find any information about it on that site right now. I can tell it. Maybe after the game, if you're really curious, you can message me in a Discord. So, I'm back here for the game. Oh, he settled right here next to Ember. And he's about to improve both of Embers. And uh, he has the Goddess of the Tides. Pantheon. Okay. He farms a good amount of culture here. One, two. Oh, and the three one. So it was the only second fish he could improve. Well, there was a such radius one. He could, he could do this. He could go for this one, but he didn't. And, oh, what the hell. It's an American scout here. Uh, okay, he just moved away. He just moved away with his scouts. And that's sad. And now those wolf is going to tear those ships apart. Uh, there's a scout, of course. And a galley. Galley, turn 23. Mm. Yeah, good timing for galley. Oh, he skipped. He skipped horses. Still good timing for galley. And settler. Poor settler with a... A limp purple scout, sure. On two and the uh, oh, it should be a discounted. It's definitely a discounted commercial hub. Very good one. Very good one. Epic. And he's going for he's going for Lady of Reeds and Marshes. And now it's a two production on a Pantanal, like a couple of months, uh, maybe this year. I uh, can't remember exactly when it was updated, but all wonders was reworked. And now if it's mountain, it's mountain. And if it's if it's swamp, it's swamp. So you'll get extra production on a Pantanal Wonder with the Lady of Rings and Marsh Pantanal. Look at this city now. It was a shitty one, but now it's to, to base and a super epic trials over here. Time and Anka works on Pantanal. Well, yeah, I guess it should. I, I'm not sure about it, Time and Anka, but it should work on Pantanal. 
uh, you can't build it on this tile because it's wonder tile, but you can build it here and probably it will it will work. And it's a uh, marsh, so you get uh, extra production and extra science here, so it will be a 2-3-3-2 two, three, three, two tile if he builds a time and of course. And I believe he'll go for it. He's aiming for it. He can build it here and boost it with uh, the other squares and uh, it would be an awesome wonder. It would be awesome wonder. I believe you even can place Lang here. They can't see if he doesn't get. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> they, they definitely can. Definitely can. Uh, but who's playing it? Who's playing it? Uh, oh, I don't know. Oh, it's JJJ. Um, oh, no, it's not JJJ. My bad. JJJ is here. I don't know who's Kanye West. Maybe it's Bizdom? Yeah. Big secret, big secret. It's a mystery. Okay, fourth city for Dido. We should she keep an eye on these guys. Fourth and fifth city for England. Uh, he has some. He does have some problems with this scout. Uh, no slingers, and I believe we just can't deal with it. We just can't. And another England. Oh, still with the second. Oh, nice blocking. Nice blocking. And he and he pillaged uh, this one. Ooh, that's a lot of tempo lost for a JJJ. Oh, no. Oh, no. Third City blocked for so long. He'll stay there till the very end. I think he should move here. But even if he moves here, it's like move, shift, enter, and you still can't kill this guy. This guy won't even die for what he's doing. He won't die for his sins. Fortunate. Yeah, second city is great. Still no harbors or what? Wait, you can build harbors, it should learn them this turn, yes, turn 25, he opens with a horse, it was pillaged, and where is builder? Builder is here, so one charge left, It'll, oh, oh, oh no, probably second, okay, next turn, he'll get it next turn, turn 26, because, uh, because other England boosted for him, yeah, I wanted to say that he couldn't boost uh, harbors here, but uh, Sandra boosted it. And he's about to take Jerusalem. He's about to take Jerusalem with a single galley. 18. Oh, not with a single galley, but a galley and a warrior. Uh, this is like a federalism boost here. Why not? He always a great tech. Uh, he could improve a couple of weak tiles. Double Victoria Bank. Yes. Double Victoria Bank. But uh, I, I I wouldn't say that it's double Victoria Bank because where is Hungary and he's having a better tempo. Um, JJJ is a bit behind, I'd say. Hungary has a, looks like a lot behind. Has four cities already. Uh, we haven't checked by until it's turn twenty six. Five turns to go. Oh no, it's not here. It's in Eras. Uh, as you can see, everyone is in a golden age already. No one picks these that have troubles with the golden age. Uh, no one likes them. Well, maybe someone likes Germany. It's old habit from a vanilla sieve like Germany. Uh, anyways, a Pantheon for America is Lady of Rinsen Marshes. We already tested this. The Pantheonal improvement. Uh, Vietnam. Mm, God of War and Plunder. Surprise, surprise. Uh, Goddess of Tides for England. Extra culture here. Somehow the tile is pillaged. Maybe there was a blizzard. I believe there was a blizzard, and blizzard can't buff uh, seed tiles, right? Uh, Hungary. Fertility rights. Extra builder and 
some extra food on kettles. I can't find any wheat, tile, rice or maize for Buddha. Uh, God of the Sea for Age of Steam Victoria. Uh, religious settlement. Religious settlement. It's a faster pillars and extra tiles. Oh, faster settlers and extra tiles. Okay. Fourth city and the fifth one about to pop up good uh, here, here you go uh, river goddess what a surprise for Khmer he should have a lot of faith like 19 well it's not that bad in total it's 124 okay uh, it's less than 200 for him that's not good and Jerusalem felt so it's only two white ones left uh, definitely not aware or is he? Oh, he's aware about Levanta. He probably sent some invoice in there. And Yeri one here to the north is aware of him too. Maybe Korea will take Yeri one. It's really good located. No, no extra food though. Oh, look at this. Three tiles improved for two pop cities. Uh, pop city. Damn. Those boats definitely don't know how to play. And Dido. Dido has uh, stone circles. Yeah, he went for stone circles and about to improve everything with tile here. Uh, where is builder? Ah, oh, it's um, improve, improve, improve. Or maybe even improve, 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 improve. Okay. Okay, fourth city on its way. Let's go to settle and bananas. Yeah, we got this perfect city. Extra gold from Kitty Y. A lot of gold. Uh, sorry, I missed it if you checked. Uh, does Korea know? It does Korea know? Dido isn't this lost yet for Dido knows Korea is... Oh yeah, we can check it. Does Korea know? Yeah, they are aware. They are aware. Well, maybe they hope there is no C, but... They, they could just check. Like Mediterranean C and here one. Oh, it's Busan Bay. Oh. Well, they can assume there is a path. And it is really hard times for Korea. Because I have to fight Hungary here. Jack will definitely... Uh, is it Jack? Um, so it's Jack, right? Probably it's, it's most likely Jack. So Jack is definitely going to play this game. Uh, going to fight Korea. Um, I, don't, I think he can use Mittler. But he opened not with the money or what? Uh, let's check. He opened with Magnus. Okay. And he's simming. So. No early game rush here. Yeah, that 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 probably most likely aware that there is a path. They can assume this. It's easier to assume that there is a path than not to. And maybe he'll build a couple of boats, or maybe even Dido can sail there and destroy a couple of cities with a uh, by Remus quite easy way. Quite easy way to win the game. <laughs> well, probably it won't happen. Another. <coughs> <coughs> oh, they can trade by sea. Oh, so it's England versus Dido. Oh, I haven't not tested it yet. And Dido will gonna have a bad time because it's only one city. It's Sugarit here. And you know what can he do? He can just spam units here and destroy England early game. I don't really want to lose. Your capital. But you can see uh, that all other cities England have on a different sea. So they can't assist capital to fight over it. Both cities should be quite equal. Maybe maybe definitely England city is better. 
in that capital is better because it's capital. It has uh, not throne. It has a palace. That looks good. He should he should win this fight? Maybe of course he can't. And by the way, uh, by the way, uh, I should keep an eye on America because America will have extra bonus damage. It's a cheating sieve where you get plus five. Maybe that was nerfed, but last time I checked, you you, you could have plus five on a naval units as well. Uh, maybe. But the curl timing is only plus three or plus four, but uh, it's still more than England would have, and especially when Regina Chile is moved, like Regina Chile swapped with the uh, Francis Drake. So, yeah, quite all this has happened. Our plaza. Oh. Oh no. No other districts built. Ah, oh, he's about to be yeah, about. Yeah, he's having more settlers. He lost population, but he got a fourth district for uh, a long. And he should replace district right here next turn, otherwise, he'll lose population once again. A couple of turns here, there's two turns. Hello. Oh, he's fine, he's fine. It's turn 30. It's turn 30 only. And one turn to go. As I remember, everyone is in a golden age. Right. So, let's take what? Let's take what? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Come here. Come on. Uh, three cities for Khmer. He's going for the third. Hold this side. And we can check the base accumulated. Uh, okay, he, has, he does have 25 base per turn. It'll be. 115 to 116 base. Oh, it's, it's okay, I guess. It's okay. It's not like 300 face, but 200 200 face is good as well. So uh, let's check influence. Oh no, in voids in Levanta from Khmer. Maybe he doesn't have any. Uh, FKDN and just Dima, and Khmer is played by Buris. I believe he'll get extra inwards right out of belief of philosophy because he will go here in theology. He'd like to have prasads, so extra invoid one, extra invoid two. So he'll have bonuses. He'll have bonuses for uh, all his sides. Maybe you can even rush mysticism with a mere really needed, but probably political philosophy is the best option. Maybe sometimes you can rush mysticism. I, I, I didn't know any player in the game who would like to rush Mr. Season. Maybe, maybe hungry or not. <laughs> With the money opening. Yeah, I guess that's that's the only, only, only option when you can rush Mr. Season. Okay, uh, Temple of Artemis for Hungary. A uh, couple of extra traders. I'm really curious about what they picked here with the Magnus. Let's check it so i really like this one it's the same thing they did with bengali and moksha and this is really cool uh it should be nerfed and then nerfed it in a perfect way i really like it extra foot and movement for settlers from the left one and extra growth and no population lost and extra production on the right one i think right one is more popular but maybe sometimes you can go left one I think right one is best because you won't lose any population with this build order, uh, with this uh, build, and uh, it can really help you to spam even more setters. Because the biggest issues when you were chopping with the Magnus and the uh, Grand Plaza is your population loss is terrible and your capital is useless for quite a long time, and your Playing your districts in the capital, but now, now it's a completely different thing. I'm not sure that if anyone will play Magnus 3 from the left and right, probably no one. Uh, so, I think the right one is the best. Four cities for Dido, as you can see. Um, 
This one's... Oh! I'd like to build a city on a wheat tile, maybe. <clears throat> but it's right in the face of Korea. It might cost him a city. <clears throat> I thought he'll go for a honey. Maybe he's planning to improve it. Um, Ancestral Hall is quite popular right now, so I believe everyone will go for Ancestral Hall. Uh, except, of course, Korea. This chamber here, wow. And he's going for Moksha and Pingala. Finally, Lang no more. It was like a madness. Everyone played that, that build. I don't think it's uh, playable now because it's taking you too long to get any bonuses. But still, extra Amintis. Uh, it, it, does it give extra Amintis right now? Uh, let's check. Yeah, extra minutes. And no gold. Oh, no gold. Yeah, but still, extra minute is kind of cool. Maybe you can go for it. Maybe you can go for it. It'll take you like 40 turns to boost 10 cities. It's like half of the game. Or even more. So if you have Lang 3 turns 32 and 40 turns on top of 10 cities, it's turn 72 when you finish your last park. Maybe turn 75 and the uh, game is about 80 turns long. Well, a regular game is about 80 turns long. Sometimes, of course, you can play very deep late, but... Yeah, that nerf... Uh, well, I'm really happy that it's it, it's over finally. I didn't like that 70% uh, of player playing this land will know that it's terrible. Now we're back on track with a Maksha Pingala or Magnus opening. That's great. Uh, how fast Korea can reach watches? 21, 23, not that good. Say once only four cities is not going for extra cities. Uh, it might be a watch a push with the four cities. Um, uh, what about Midland? They are aware of it, and yeah, it does have a, a single void there. Ooh. Okay, harbors. So I was aiming for. I remember I was going for uh, currency, but now he switched for ship building. And he got two carries heading to Taito. They probably can't do much, but maybe they can pillage this Gotham. Oh, another another buy room here. And you know how it's done. You check. Oh, he has twenty two. Hmm. What can it be? Maybe it's a galley. <laughs> That's definitely a galley. <laughs> so you build your own galleys. That's good. Yeah, so six is like open books. I, I, you know, sometimes you can, you can say like, it's not interesting enough. You can't surprise attack your opponent, but we still have surprises, surprise attacks. Um time to times uh, but on c5 it was completely mystery everyone was attacking the leader and even if you just one production behind uh, your statistics won't be showed it it was quite terrible and uh, the, the culture of a of attacking leader was quite common in a c5 multiplayer gameplay like in an ffa i don't really remember uh, that uh, two versus two formats. I believe you can't play more than three players, three versus three. Like more, you can play more than six players in set five. Oh, there you go, ancestral hall, popular build orders, ancestral hall here, ancestral hall for England. Uh, we don't know it yet. We'll see. A horseman. Now this chamber for Korea is not about to build a lot of cities. He has five already. Ooh, interesting. Uh, pyramids. How about pyramids? Pyramids, one of the best wonders. Super strong. Still, three cities for Khmer. He built two settlers and about to settle them. Uh, out of this chamber, somehow. Hmm. I think it's good for Kimir to go for audience chamber. You don't really need extra food, you don't really need extra 
housing. So maybe it's all about amenities, but you'll have extra amenities, as I remember, from an Equidox. So if he just went for a ancestral hall, you could get a builder here and builder here. And you could play white with a with a with a monumentality, right? Hmm. Let's check his religion. It's a choral music and lamb ministry. He should have about forty. So the three on the Okay. Uh, he'll get more. He'll get more once he sends some invoice. And he should rush. Yes, yeah, he's, he's about to hit theology turn 35. Ooh. Theology turn 35. That's great result. So Prasad's about to be finished. Wow. Theology turn 35. That's, that's really fast. Ah, it's thanks to the corals and the ministry. Yeah, right. Well, mostly to the corals. Yeah, monument, monument, and I'd say it's extra for culture for him right there. Yeah, he definitely could get the builders over here and here. I don't know, is it okay to build this? It looks like the meta is changing and Ancestral Hall is more popular. Check the M. Okay. What is the M? You get them pop lot faster than you can go to a war at GMC. Okay. There, yeah, but there is no direct message. I just checked, no direct message. Maybe from Mikado? Yeah. I have no direct message in a Discord. Maybe I banned you. <laughs> and you just can't say, uh, send me messages. Okay, there you go. Ancestral Hall 1. Uh, Dido should go for Ancestral Hall. Hall. No, he's not. So, 1 for no. What about England's? Audience chamber. Yeah, for, for naval seas it's kinda good to have audience chamber because you're still problems with the fresh water. At least for a while. Oh, it was for another user. Oh sorry. I thought it for me. Oh there you go, there you go, there you go. The warrior push. Oh, I thought it would be you know could be swordsman. Uh let's check Hungary's four turns or he opened it. They do have a good amount of fire. Oh, and Lanos is not sharing car with his allies. Mm, you probably should. You probably should. Anyways, even more cities here. One, two, three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen this before. And Jack has a lot of, uh, a lot of chops. Like one, two. Chops left, and he probably can chop jungles as well because I mean, for those months, and he definitely opened bronze working. Force, oh, it's a force fire. Bradford is not the tallest city. Oh, wow. Well, yeah, you'd like to destroy Mitla while you can, and he is out of time. He has like, what, four turns? Have he killed? Oh, check doesn't have any boost for it. Maybe America can boost it. So we can check stats 32, 29 for America. Only 15 and 40 for Vietnam. What the hell, Vietnam? Why is it low science? Where is it? It's a yellow one. Yellow turtle. Ah. Oh. Got it, it's um, commercial hubs, okay, okay, more gold, less science, there's 6 and 23 for Hungary, where is Hungary, and 11, 22 for Dido, wow, 11 science, that might cost him a game, because, you know, 
Uh, there is a chance that Korea will just rush Korea's, which he's doing right now. He's about to open Mathematic. It's like, screw you guys, I'm going to destroy Dido. I see, and it would be awesome if it would be awesome if they added those. Uh, is it was it Kabuxo? I, I can't remember how they called called they, their uh, unique uh, armored ships. Like not only watches, but unique iron ships for this guy. <laughs> so if, if he if he on a on a naval naval map, he would dominate na dominate the sea. It can be. Uh, I don't know, maybe it's a like caravel timing, but it could be more like Iron Clouds, like plus 5, like 16. 60, can you imagine 60 caravel? Or at least 58. Maybe a stronger frigates like uh, 50, 50, 50 or something. It would be nice to have it. It would be fun. Mm -hmm. Four cities. Oh, it's an ancestral. It's an under's chamber for Dido. Yeah, probably aware that he must fight here with an England, and the second city, Bristol, was settled on this. See, and he might have a fight against uh, Korea. So, Dido is in a hard hard position here and no more cities built so normally you build a bit more cities when you're aiming for out of chamber only now second trade road third road about to be done turn 40 yeah you'd, you'd like to rush this for for a free trade road um i think dido is is, is going to die not enough cities not enough stats and two open ends really hard hungary have to Deal good amount of chop, or not Hungary, sorry. Uh, Vietnam have to deal good amount of chop, harassing England to prevent uh, this naval combat. And I don't know what can you do against Korea because Hungary is not that far away and he can t surely can attack it, but have to deal also with the uh, Age of Steam Victoria. Uh, luckily, luckily, luckily for Hungary, Mitla survived. He got money over there, right? Yes. Uh, five invoice already to the money and the Hungarian features. Mm, those horses can do nothing, unfortunately. And even more settlers coming out of Buda. And look at this it's seven pop cities, it's about 20 production, I believe. 16 production right now. It's a 16 production right now. Ooh, naval city. Mm. He's planning to trade with the Vietnam by sea, right? Um, there is an option over here, maybe somewhere southern, or maybe this city, or maybe just a just a fast city like turn four city. Wait, one, one, two, three, four. If this one and a three, so turn if this tile. Have little jungles there so you can build districts. Yeah. That's doing great. Two, three, five, five. Cities for Korea. And he's not making any more. He's going to rush some something. I'm not sure what. That looks like Yeah, it's buttress. Okay. Okay, now we have now Dada has problem. There's some serious problem, like 19 science against 53 already. With a buttress. So with the Batches, Hungary definitely can take any, with the Carwell, Hungary won't take any Korean cities. He might pillage some districts, but I don't even think that he will attack any any soon. Because he's building a lot of uh, settlers. He of course might go for Corsairs and just rebuild uh, horsemen to upgrade them later. Uh, and he can just raid. Knowing that he won't be able to take city, he might just go for raiding uh, activities, and I believe that is what's gonna happen. He will raid England and uh, Korea later, but for now, Dido is about to lose naval fight. It's 2027, 20, maybe with a boost, she can 
keep up but uh, in total look at this it's already 200 science it's more than 200 it's 250 science behind and with the 20 science it's what uh, 10 11 12 13 okay 12 turns he's 12 turns behind if you want uh speed up well maybe it's not 12 turns because we uh, have to spend a bit more science for the first open tech but still Oh, there you go, Arena, and he's about to chop Coliseum on the scuttle tile, I believe. With a bum bum, um, what's it called? Uh, Theatral Square, Theatral Square, Coliseum, and big Theatral Square around this. Yeah, another one, theater, another Theatral Square on a stone, and maybe some wonder over here. It would be awesome to have a. a I think in gardens for Khmer. I don't know what they built. They have uh, no, no one builds wonders except uh, Hungary. Oh, Itamenanke! There you go. It's happening, boys. It's happening. It's four turns for Itamenanke and the Panther will have plus four production. Ooh, that's massive. Oh, look at this. Damn, I haven't seen this for a while. Oh yeah, it's a. Uh, Oh, it's, uh, it's Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, he has bonus for aqueducts. Oh, you can grow tall and bonus for uh, for industrials. And the free units from industrials and extra two amenities from industrials. As I remember, they changed nothing. That's great. Oh, look at this volcano. What a nice trials. Of course, he lost bananas and everything else, but three, two, three, three trials. Nice and extra science is good as well. Uh, 53, 34, 45 culture for Khmer and only 25, 28 for Dido. Okay, Dido is rushing sands right now. He's okay, making some projects. Maybe with the with the admirals he can so he can survive. Uh, let's check it. Let's check it. Yeah, Korea will have no admirals at all. But Artemisia was taken by Dido. Guys, do this for uh, Wiki and Themistocles for another Wiki. And Hanno the Navigator for another because now we're we're having who? Regenerate Chola here, so it's a privateer. Ooh, with the privateer you well it will be easier for you to defend against Carbots without a general. But maybe, maybe Korea. Oh Korea's about to get one. It's 1.1 for now. And maybe he's making some projects. Yes, he's going for projects. But he definitely can get an admiral here with a single actually there's two. No, it's only one with a single uh, harbor. Oh, and the hanging garden here. With this uh, Korean temple, we probably don't have um, era shift turn 53, I guess. It's not like it's it's not an 80 science like some guys can do by these timings. It's only 52, but it will be even more later. Um, and uh, um, <clears throat> it's unfortunate for them, but Hungary is controlling Mitla, so Korea would have even more science, but no, not this time. Okay. Um, can he chop anything? Even if he chop all the jungles around, it won't be enough to build Colosseum, so he'll have to chop stone, this one, this one is three, four, and there's a lot of work to do here. The chop Coliseum. Um, 78 si uh, face per turn, that's a good one. Yeah, you should have more than 60 by turn 40. And he definitely had them way earlier because of turn 35 theology. There you go, builders, builders, builders. We'll go we're gonna chop. Oh, wait. He just opened uh, Theodolism. Yeah, Theodolism is here. Uh, five charge builders buy out awesome. Damn culture is so strong. If you have good enough good amount of culture, that Theo tech is truly helpful. Okay, Hungary is pushing England. Uh there you go, the encampment city. About to be set on others. It's a brave, brave, it's one brave settler. Uh no units around it. Hmm. 
Yeah, he expects no units here. Uh, Swan and the knight. Oh no, not like this. Like, look at this. You see? Never trust, never trust uh, this. No, never trust the game, never trust the game. For 7, 43. Oh, he can push. What do you do for the 7? Okay, no, he can't push. Well, he can, but that looks like England can defend, and ancient walls is already construct uh, is under construction in Bradford. Uh, 2231 and he's having for apprenticeship and even more cities, even more cities was built in Buddha. Go, go, go. That that right promo pr promotion is super good. Super good. We can check yields for now. It's 98 for Abraham Lincoln. Whoa, why so big? How so big? Uh, no industrials built yet, just replaced. Oh, it's built like, okay. I thought they just replaced it, but... That is how so big. It just it just built like plus five industrials everywhere. And even more. And even more. And he's about to Oh yeah, it's working! Lan is working on Pantanal. Look at this, two, three, and it will be two, four, four, two tiles. That's a really good city. It's a truly a gift for America. And he's having a great time, but thanks to Partially thanks to this. It's 65, 48 for him and 119 production. Absolute giga chat. Um, absolute unit. 82 for Hungary, thanks to the number of cities. Six cities for him. Uh, 242. 242 in six cities. Good tempo. And a lot of districts, by the way, built. So thanks to the district discount, surely. Uh, 2332 and 82 production, so you'll see. Doing great. 34, 33 for Dido. He's aiming for mathematic only and cartography is five turns to be opened. It's five turns till cartography for Daniel. And he's taking Yerevan. He's taking Yerevan. Yeah, unfortunately, Buris can't use the city and only city he can use is Levanta. Let's check. Okay. And the invoice there. No. But he's definitely aware of it. No, he's not. And look at this. It's a couple of horses. He'll rush Dido. And he'll destroy her. And that looks like he'll, he must build some extra units. Because he's aware that Yerevan is dying. And it's not like... He's dying from disaster. No. He's dying from horses. Two, maybe two is not enough. Oh, buy out from the city state. Nice move. Uh, extra gold, by the way. Oh, most likely to pillage extra gold for upgrades. 74 times 4, it's 350 gold. A bit less than 350 gold. And it's two extra caravels. Oh, he's planning to take this city. Uh, he's planning to pillage, take this city, buy out a couple of tiles, and upgrade units right here. Maybe. Well, it does look like he's planning to do so. You can buy out this one, tile, this one, and this one. So he'll upgrade. And that will have gonna have a bad time. There is two ways, like from the north, northern one. I believe that I can hold this one with a couple of uh, pyrims, but there is northern one path that is way harder to hold. And I don't think that he has time. I don't think he does have time to do so. Only now campus as well as turn 43 is okay. Damning for campuses, I guess. But no chances for Dido here. Even if he survives uh, north, northern attack, if, even if he survives, he barely can do anything and Korea is securing his um, naval cities with this move, with this bold move. Okay. Okay, and from the south, of course. Uh, oh, there you go, Francis Drake. Cor no, it's a new meta now. Oh, uh, what have you done, guys? But it's really cool. That's really cool. You can use this unit and... No, I think it's even worth now. Whoa, it's even worse now. 
Oh my goodness, what have you done? It's unpredictable consequences. <laughs> we had we had like Rajendra Chola. We had Rajendra Chola. Uh, rush previously, but people in most cases couldn't use it immediately, so it's most it's more like a late game investment. And now you can have you can have a private here. You can have a sea dog with a core, which absolute unit now. Look at this. It's one shot and no damage in return. Unlike a previous uh, option where you have to wait till you open cartography uh, to get a uh, core with uh, seven movements. And it's still an option. But now we have even more options with the Francis Drake. Oh no, no chance for Ugarit. No, 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 it, it, it's bad. You have to fix it. Go back, go back. I think it will be reverted because it's impossible to counter. Well, it, it's possible to counter, just have to rush admirals. So, uh, as I see this, as I this, see this situation, um, people were annoyed. Yep. F for Dima. E. Well, you know what? You know what? Dima is experienced player and he knows when he can build escape settler and we ha and when he cannot. And I think it's about time to build an escape settler. So the fourth uh, fourth uh, fifth city is an escape or fourth settler is an escape settler. Go Dima. <laughs> Yes, I agree with you. This one is uh, too 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 much. This one is too much. I think someone is tricked, uh, community to approve this path, or maybe they didn't think that. Like, what can happen if you give a privateer that early? What worst? What the worst thing can happen? Well, you can absolutely destroy opponents, opponents uh, pre-builds. That is what's gonna happen. Uh, Seed Dogs is here. They are in an exploration. It's a Renaissance era unit. And you get him like in medieval. Not in medieval. You know, uh, previously all admirals was taken before turn 40. Like turn 40 and 42 because players was chopping everything to get to Jandri Chola. And now if you chop everything to get a privateer and you're not that far away from your opponent. Well, you know. Maybe it should give no privateer but something else. But look at this, it's 50-65. You can't do nothing. He'll just shoot he'll just shoot you. You just can't. Once again another player was destroyed by by a temper temporary meta temporary meta put the free privateer back to drake oh, with the drake is kind of useless it's really cool one maybe mm, you should focus your projects to prevent this kind of situation but even without a even without a core it still can do much Mm. Well, uh, like plus three is not that big of a deal, I guess. Uh, the problem was that players was forced. Uh, I, I don't know about CPL, but in French community, I guess, but I've seen it most likely from the French players. When everything is chopped, you skip, uh, you skip, um, Lighthouses, you chop everything to get Rajandri Chola. And that was an issue. They tried to fix it, well, it didn't work. There should be a you know hot fix of this. 
There's no chance for Dido to survive. And it's not a regular save. It's Dido. It has 35 military bonus. And it's still one shot. Maybe, maybe, you know, you know, you know, maybe a single sea dog is not a big of a deal. He most likely can't one shot a unit, but combined with a core, uh, uh, it's really hard to deal anything against it. But we'll see, maybe it won't, uh, it won't do anything. Uh, I don't know. It's Sandra is a quite fast player, a super superiorly fast. It's really hard to watch his gameplay. Well, uh, for me, I'm not that, uh, I'm not that fast. I guess maybe I'm just getting old. Uh, but <laughs> you know, definitely I've have now a APM to last move, first move this uh, by reams. Should be easy, easy for him. Okay, botches for Dido. So it's fifty-five thirty-eight. Oh, okay. I was. Wrong about Dima. He finished uh, this plus eight campuses. Now he has good amount of science, fifty-five thirty-eight uh, culture. Not that good amount of culture. He's aiming for mercenaries. I believe he does have uh, alliance. Yes, both of them have have it. Mm. Ah, look at this. Yeah, last move, first move, he killed a few couple of units. <gasps> oh, I forgot you can capture. Okay, that's a sea dog. It got by Rima. No way. There's no way, no way. It's really hard. Oh, dear God. Yeah, that's why England's so strong. Those abusers. Oh, there you go. Reina. Uh, do we have any Reina city? By the way, still no Pingala internals meta. <laughs> <coughs> oh, there you go. Coliseum. Oh, I believe it, just, it was just built. And some golden districts. Are they suffering from god losses? Oh, they need some gold for Korea to upgrade. Uh, it's, uh, boom, 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 boom. it's less than 100. 70, 88. 87, actually. And you can check that Hungary and America to... I know, Dido as well. They generate a good amount of gold. Oh, it's... Uh, everyone will generate a good amount of gold. Oh, a free, free man at arms, free man at arms. Damn. Abraham Lincoln looks good now. It was okay. I, I, I don't know why people hate him. It was okay, but now with a cheaper aqueduct, it's even better. Free units is always good. You just rush district like he did. And uh, you just build it, you get free units, you're secured. You don't have to go uh, anywhere. Well, maybe with the double campuses. It is better for you to open military tactics before you construct industrial zones. Well, you can go apprenticeship, military tactics, and then you finish industrial zones and get mana charms. Free mana charms, by the way. Uh, it's a good one. It's a good build order for America. One, two, three, four, five. He's settling six and seven cities now. Uh, and eight one in production. So everything's good for him. Uh, what about Vietnam? Uh, <laughs> like a giant triangle here. Giant triangles. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a park. Oh, it's a park. I wasn't aware of that. Like one, two, three parks already done. It's turn 47. Uh, it's, it started turn 35. Is it worse? It's 35, 73. Well, good amount of culture is for Vietnam, but not good enough. Science is not good enough. What? Ox Daniel, every time I play Lincoln, I spump and do ah, every time I uh -huh, and go bankrupt. Well, why are you going bankrupt? These units are free. 
Oh, you mean you have no markets? Well, um, he went for a discount, so he got two of these. Get discount for two of uh, yellow ones. Discount for current plaza and one turned this to industrial zone because it most likely were discounted as well. And but this build order, I can't remember. I think you can even have a third discount for this one, but I'm not sure. But you should have a good amount of production right now. Like 50 production in you early and you can check to, to, to 228 for him. 80, 65, it's absolute unit and he's going to wreck someone. Uh, where can he attack? He can attack England. Uh, maybe he can even aim for... Uh, he's going for military tactic. Maybe he can even aim for... Um, one infantry with that. I'm not sure, but he's about to get even more units with the workshops. Uh, I believe he... yeah, I can check. Uh, where is America? Here. Let's go for this. Um, oh, sorry, this one. Yep, he's having... he can use it, he can use it. He's not using it now, but he's definitely gonna use it later. Um, we can check Eros, by the way. Oh, they denounced me. Uh, five turns. Oh, look, I guess this turn 53. I guess correctly. And we have a Caravels push. Caravels push against that. That has a lot of rebuilds to the north. So Dima, Dima feels safe. And because he can upgrade even more boats, he can upgrade more boats than uh, Korea upgraded. Uh, so it's 140, 204, 258, 158 gold for uh, Forever Young, right? And uh, 100 gold, just a bit more than 100 gold for one last ride. Or I'm missing something. Yeah, I guess it's one last ride. Not enough, not enough gold for Korea. Just not enough gold. Well, I don't think he can push through this. Has a general? Oh, does? Wait, wait, wait. Does Dido have a general? Admiral. Marius. Medieval Renaissance. Okay. Yeah, he got it. Marius. Sure. Where is uh, private here? Oh, he just retreated. Huh. Maybe it's not that strong as I thought. It looks terrible. But he can't go out because those galleys will just shred him. You can see the damage is, damage is quite strong. Hmm. So... In general, he killed like two of pre belts with this cost cost unit, costly unit. Huh. Look at this! Look at this! He finished at Tamananke, the best city in the world, Charleston. Look at that beautiful tile. Yeah, I should definitely use this as a preview. I'm gonna make a screenshot so I won't have to look. Uh, to, to look at on a video later. Mm. These units have like plus 7, right? So it's 45 plus 4 oligarchy plus 5 alliance plus 7, 61 strength. I'm not sure Carwell and City plus 1 will hold this. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, oligarchy doesn't work on these things. Oligarchy works only on the melee unit. It's a range unit, so oligarchy doesn't work. And he has no general, so he waste his... Okay, okay, he got Lef Erikson. He got Lef Erikson. So if you use uh, Chola, you must get another general for your mid um, for Renaissance units. They have to take two, like, for the general Chola. If you want to use it, you must have two admirals. 
and sometimes it's really hard to do. So there is a counter for this. Okay, maybe it's not that terrible. Maybe it's not that terrible. Uh, practice will show. Practice will show. But it looks like it looked it looked very scary. I thought Dido will lose Uber it immediately, but well, everything went even better. Now we have a push from the north, but we can see the damage here. It's it's nothing. Like only four, five, six, seven. Okay, seven caravels. It's not enough. It's not enough. One turn till Dido upgrade. He's going for a Mister Sims to switch policy cards, and with the, good, with the gold they have, it's like one k gold. So it's ten caravels with an admiral. Yeah, I guess Korea can't beat it, and he have to go back. And now he's having troubles, right? Uh, for bronze working, Hungary is uh, seeming hard. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we have a constant war over here. Uh, one, two, three, four levied. Five levied swordsmen, a couple of archers, actually four archers. Levied uh, heavy chariot, a lot of levied unit here. And he is. Uh, he controlled this territory with a levied unit. It's really cheap one. That's awesome gameplay by Hungary. And he, ha he forces. Uh, who's this playing? Is JJJ to hold a good amount of units here to just not tie? Um, classical encampment in the face. Uh, is it on a hill? Oh, okay, it's on a hill. There's no hill, so you can you can shoot Bradford if it will be finished. It cost him a city. That is why he's holding it. Okay, okay, good, good. Look at this, big haboob, luckily he ha like a small haboob, it's tiny haboob, but he haven't to destroy any tile. Okay, great. Survived against the odds. Whoa. That's, uh, that's awesome, that's awesome uh, gameplay from Dima. So I thought he will dead here, I thought he was dead here, but nice campuses. Good reaction against uh, uh, frig uh, not frigate, uh, sea dog, sea dog play, and he's in a super good position. Now. Look at this, no chances here. You, you might, you might go, you might go back. And where is uh, Jander Shola, by the way? Is he even an option? To have Fernand Magellan. Ferguson was taken by England. So Vernon Magellan and somewhere there is Regina Shalahari. Or Francis Drake. Oh, right, it's Francis Drake. Fine. Sorry. They swapped their bonuses. Ooh. Where's America? Stirrups. Oh. It's the city right in the face of England. And you have to fight back. I don't think England will have any problems with this because the uh, next Golden Age uh, surely will be a free inquiry for him. Uh, we're gonna have a test. Ah, oh, Sander knows how to play. He's going for naval tradition. He's the best boy. Look at this. Two turns to go. Three turns till naval, naval tradition. And he'll use policy card right after he switch era. I'm usually forgot this uh, policy card and uh, you know only six or five turns after I can use it and he'll use it from the very first turn so for 20 turns he'll have double amount of uh, gold from each of his harbor and of course science that's good one that's good one so that is not a big deal for him they just have to now now I just have to build some units let's check his production 155 for Al Adolf, Adolf Lincoln Abraham <laughs> Uh, Lincoln. Yeah, it's from Rick and Morty. I, I don't remember how his actual name was, but... <laughs> yeah, anyway, uh, 255 for him. Uh, only 57 for Dima, okay. <laughs> we gave 57. Yeah, Dima is definitely not in the game. 
uh, because he lost two times. Oh, I lost a lot. Of... Tiny Haboop destroyed his production here, but it's not. Uh, it won't make any difference. Fifty-seven only. It's terrible. And the Green Hills, where he chopped everything for pre-builds, and he haven't improved it, and he have improved nothing. But he survived, so that's the most important thing. That's the most important thing. Sixty-three, thirty-seven. Good for 752 for 100, 160 here, 190 for Vietnam. What the hell is wrong with Vietnam? Why is only 190? Oh no, is it a rage quit? Okay, I'm just kidding. How can he have 190? How do you even... How do you even play Vietnam? Should it have more production? Usually people have more. 119 to 152. Not good at all. Oh, it's it's a uh, it's a uh, classical. Oh, sorry, I pasted something. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. No, no, it's not like that. It's definitely not like that. You can of course check the current type. Oh, maybe waiting for Chichen Itza. Yeah, but uh, you know he has, does have a good amount of he does have a good amount of culture. Chichen Itza is in guilds, so you should have this one if you naval. You should have guilds if you're going for um for inquiry. Uh, by the way, for inquiry is super popular right now. It's more popular than it used to be after they buffed uh, um how it's called commercials. Uh, you have extra. Production uh, adjacency bonus from a city state. So this one is plus four, uh, plus three, uh, plus two, plus three, and plus four. It can be even plus five if you place it in other districts somewhere, somewhere around here. I think he's waiting for Chichen Itza. I think you're right. But the Chichen Itza will have great uh, trials, and, and because Vietnam has a lot of. Oh, title left. Because Vietnam has a lot of. Uh... Culture, you can even rush mercantilism, right? Where you can build um, lumber mills or rainforests. But still, it's 119 when when America has uh, more than 200. 153 for Khmer, and I haven't checked Eras yet, so we'll do it. Right after they join the game. 153 for Khmer. 121 for FKTN. Uh, where is it? There, there he is. Where is he? There he is. Uh, 154 Age of Steam Victoria. Mm, where is your industrials? There they are. And only 92 or Sandro or Age of Empire 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 yeah it does have it has some improved chance right 1, 2, 3 here, there he builds he builds builders everywhere so he's good good on that but maybe he just not maybe he just have not enough lands to work on like it's uh, not the best land. It's not the land you'd like to see when you're playing uh, industrial sea. You need more hills. And there's only water tiles. And by the way, new Oakland. Maybe with Oakland he would have more. Oh, actually, there's Singapore. Johannesburg. I missed Singapore. No, I think I, I didn't. I think I missed Johannesburg. I don't. I can't. Can't remember right now. What I was saying an hour ago. Maybe it was more. The game is super cool. Um, unfortunately, we have this lag to 52 and we had a rough start because for some reason I had some problems with connection. Don't know why. Yep, Korea just retreated. Dima survived. Uh, but for how long? We must build. Well, I think it's time for an escape settler. Maybe he's not aware, but he have no trials improved at all. 
Look at this. One. Uh, he lost his capital improvement. Okay, we can count it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven tiles and four cities. Um, not counting naval tiles, which is one, two, okay, maybe three. Okay, two, two, two for now. So it's nine tiles and four cities improved for 52 turns. Hildeberga. Hildegarda, sorry. Hildegarda. Such a sweet name. Hildegarda. Even more cities for Vietnam. Yeah, extra settler. But this one. Oh, they're planning to push with the with the with upgraded units or what? Are they? Are they? Are they? Uh, I think they can't do any. I think they can't do much because of a sea dog. Sea dog is going back. That is why he's going back. Because of this threat. Oh, we can stay here and shoot some units. Hmm. And you can maybe even steal some tiles. Pillage some tiles. Hey, wait, 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 what? Why it's not four? Why it's not four? So Pantheon. Liang Itaminan. It should be four. Why not four? Are city parks still good? N n I don't think so. N well, maybe it's it's maybe it can be used to boost amenities, like if you're on a single continent. Mm, maybe you can use it to boost amenities. But it takes you to too long. It takes you too long to build them. Well, you can see that Vietnam has one, two, three, four, and you can see his stats. Like he haven't go for a Magnus and Tunnels. It's hundred thirty two. Well, it's it's okay. It's nice stats here, and I believe he does have good amenities. Yeah, he has, he has plus ten percent bonus. In every city, well, except Hong Kong. Yeah, even more, even more many turns moving thousands. Look at this, two turns, two turns, two turns. Oh, he's gonna have even more cities. And Abraham Lincoln is good now. Well, he was good. I don't know why I have no one played him. Someone told that he's bad Civ, and uh, no one like to play him. I don't know. It's like uh, fifty, like okay, fifty percent discount, or sometimes faster production on uh, Aqueduct. It saves you what twenty production. Because aqueduct should cost as a current plaza, it's it costs not as a regular district. It's cheaper itself. It's cheaper itself. Now it's even cheaper, so it's like one ton aqueduct. Previously it would cost you like what two tons? If you build it early. So nothing much changed but Somehow, somehow now it's good. <laughs> yeah, of course it's better to have a cheaper aqueduct. Maybe it was a big plan of the uh, of uh, um, American community and save game. So they told that Abraham Lincoln is bad, so you have to buff it. It it got buffed now. It's Simba. Well, it's not Simba. It's just a solid C right now. But you can see that two hundred seventy five production gives you <laughs> make you to think, make you to revalue. Your civ opinion, I guess. 
175. Nice. Even Hungary, Hungary with the uh, which uh, in most cases have good amount of production. With the uh, improved trials and Magnus and Charles still has 171. Maybe because of early science, America got better time for sh because of an apprenticeship rush. Sure. And he doesn't have to build anything, he doesn't have to play with a city state like Hungary. And he has no um, neighbors to fight, but he'd like to fight them, you know, with the free mana charms. Oh, and by the way, those mana charms has plus five, right? They do have plus five. Yep, from Abraham Lincoln trade, you can see it here. Oh, I think it's locked. Oh, no. No, they did. Okay. Um, I don't know a single person who would check every single message here. I think the only message you should have here is uh, is about the trades. Maybe of course some wonders, like but. The only really necessary one is about the traders. Eventually you'll see that you lost a wonder. I've never checked this. Like if I build if I'm building some wonder. If I'm building some wonder. If I'm constructing a wonder. I just and I lose it. I know it because I, it's disappeared in my city production queue, but not here. So, I would be happy if there was a big button, you have a trade deal. Big button, you have a trade deal. Because I never know when I have a deal, trade deal, because of all this spam, useless spam. Like maybe it's okay for guys who play Civ uh, in a single player. They have all the time in the world and they're okay to spend half an hour for a turn. Like chill gameplay. But for a multiplayer, we just have no time to deal with all this crap. Grand Master Chapel for Khmer, right? It's a good one. We can check uh, gold income. Um, it's a bit even worse. But it's slightly better, but it does look like it's worth. Oh, uh, for, for Korea, right? Then? Oh, no, it's even now, huh? So, uh, one, two... 63, 260... 270, okay, 270. And here... Uh, it's one, two, 20. Okay, 270 against 220. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, we're about to have a golden age. Uh, we just had a golden age. So, uh, Taito in a dark age. Ooh, it might work him well. But he might push with a plus five. Oh, those galleys. Anton and Arivo is blogging the way. And Korea is in a normal age, which is even worse. So, Taito have an advantage. And he can probably push through. And I should check um, Oligar Hipponosis. So I should vote B something, because we'll vote is voting A, and I should vote B profits here, and B for uh, the spectator. Okay, let's hope for the best. Let's hope for the best. Ah, temple. Why would you build temple? Maybe he's planning to have a religion. Maybe he was planning to have a religion, but he couldn't get it. Okay, oligarchy. What about oligarchy? Ooh. Okay, oligarchy legacy for both of them. So it's plus five from uh, Twilight Whaler for Dido. Uh, is he an, an oligarchy? Yeah, he can use both of these bonuses. Oligarchy bonus and Twilight Whaler. Okay. Uh, 
Korea has way less units, way fewer units, but it's a one tile chokes. It's one tile chokes everywhere. Maybe he could uh, place the city. Maybe he can settle the silent passage of Tantra. Yeah, we have the the sink here. We're having the sinks because of that double disconnection, double disconnect. Oh, that even going south, but uh, there is there is Sidok fleet and uh, some units can be upgraded. Guys, go really low B on the lower. Yeah, we're good with that, and maybe we can have a ton. Maybe we can even have a ten. Minute break. Okay, let's check resolutions. Okay, we can't. Go for a going for a lobby. Let's get some bomb bots there or make an encampment for year one. Yeah, this chat is not helping at all. Maybe I can move him. Maybe I can move it. So we're here because I can't see anything on a minimap, and I used I, I I'm used to use it a lot. Oh, maybe I can remind. No, I shouldn't. Okay, uh, lob links. We have a lob link. By the way, guys, have you checked Age of Wonders? I really love in this game. Looks good. Maybe it's just because it's new. Maybe it's just because it's new. Maybe I won't. Mm. I will bore. I will bore. I'll. How to say it? Uh. Okay. Oh, maybe I'll get bored in time. Oh, yeah. I know. I just couldn't remember how to say it. Maybe I'll get bored in time with it. But for now, it, it looks good. I yeah, just demo can't connect. I think we have some prob problems. Yeah, I think I should uh, avoid games with the root teams because we have a very bad connection for some reason. It used to be okay, but now it's super bad. Okay. Oh, it's five from Vietnam. Okay, I didn't know that that damage, uh, that uh, production is okay for Vietnam. Okay, Dima is connecting. So last time it was permanently connected, connecting. This time is connected immediately. So go, go, go. So the game is far from the game is far from over, but there might be such a thing as a sudden concede, uh, sudden forfeit. I don't know why, but sometimes teams like playing, 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 playing. Uh, of course, they are behind, just a little bit behind, uh, but it's not clear, and they just forfeit. Sometimes, like a couple of times, there was a game when winning team for feet it's it was <laughs> it was surprising
The game is great for single player, but I don't like watching streams of it edited. You have built great cities only. of stone. And Too much micromanagement. Rise and well, it's it's a lot of micromanagement, and uh, it's like a you know like in a heroes of might and magic, where you have uh, where you must be very active on a on a map. Like I have a lot, uh, and this one, this game gives you a lot of units under your control, so you can spread them. Not not Civ, but uh, not Civ game, Age of Wonders. So you can spread them. You can collect all the things on the map. Uh, but but it's fine. It just looks like a lot of micro micromanagement. Uh, you got you you have a lot of micromanagement in a Civ game. Just about a mechanical uh, memory for your hands. If you're play, playing a lot, you'll do uh, things automatically, not even thinking about this, and it will be like like Sandra plays. Oh, okay. Far axis. Rex's crash. Play, play, play. Damn, those Phyraxis crashes. You know what? It's it's not only a Civ problem. Every single game have this. Every single game have this. You, if you haven't played any other games, well, they're not perfect as well. Yeah, everyone's going through tutorials and playing slowly, so pacing is a bit off for streaming, not for long, I guess. No, no, it, it, yeah, yeah, it's like, uh, well, it's not for long, surely. Uh, maybe a month. Maybe a month. People are, like, my first game uh, took me, what, eight and a half hours. Oh, I haven't checked things. Fuck. Oh fuck. Oh no, it's good. So my first game uh, took me 8 hours to make 80 moves. And I wasn't playing on the hard difficulty. And on a super hard difficulty you have to fight every single battle. Like and it, it's uh, it's a bit annoying. I don't like this. I'm okay to fight uh, crucial battles like with the uh, 18 units on a battlefield, but not, but not uh, again like you not every single one. Of... It's really exhausting. Uh, people just learning game. They don't know meta. They don't know any tactics. They're just randomly clicking everything. I visit my friends uh, today and we discuss it. And he's he was playing terribly bad. In my opinion, it was not efficient at all. Uh, but eventually, I'm not sure about multiplayer. I believe no one will play multiplayer on a super hard difficulty because you have to fight every single battle there. Uh, maybe on a normal where you can uh, auto combat almost everything and you basically have to fight not the map itself but the players. Will It will work better. It will work better. So it's turn 54, we skipped a couple of turns, uh, nothing much happened here, nothing much happened here, and is anything going to happen there? No, England is about to finish Ugarit, but it's not a big deal because Tyler still has three more cities to the north, it can definitely defend himself. 
Oh, St. Louis has some problems here. Minus point a minus one point eight is not a big deal. Okay, ancient walls for London. Maybe it's not London. Yeah, it's definitely not London. One, two, three, four, six, seven cities for Vietnam. Okay, still waiting for a uh, Chichen Itza. Yes, keep those jungles alive. Well, it's good for Vietnam, I guess. Oh, the first Voi Chen. First Voi Chen. We won't have that many of them, like three or four, maybe. Oh, they denounced me. Well, and those guys who denounced me couldn't finish turn on time. Yeah, you have to force out a combat, but AI have those. Oh, I haven't used corpse explosion yet. I believe they can improve AI somehow, but he, I have to admit, he fights terribly bad. He, he can lose units in uh, quite safe situations. Maybe in a one versus one you can play like in a Heroes of Might and Magic where you have uh, like simultaneous turns till you meet each other and after that uh, you have a timer like uh, 20 minutes or something for turn maybe it will it will need less so you can fight your battles and definitely you can re 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 fight like retry I want to try multiplayer, but not now. I'm still learning the game, maybe a bit later. But let's back to, to our game, let's back to our game. Here we have super strong, super really strong America. Uh, I haven't checked era, so let's do it right now. So, uh, 7 cities, 37 population, turn 55. 7 cities, 37 population for Vietnam, with 142 uh, production, 107 science and 86. Uh, culture. Uh, next one is America with eight cities already. He just built one, St. Louis. Uh, 49 pops. 49 pops. That's great result. And almost 300 production. 104 and 90. 104 and 90 culture. Uh, check. As 100 science, 42 culture. Ooh. Oh. Right. Okay, the Kisivani. And 9 cities, 49 pops. Good. 4 cities, 28 pops, and almost no production, science, and culture for Dido. But he's in a quite bad spot here. Well, he's struggling. He's struggling here. Uh, their opponents, Khmer. Puris with only 102 culture, that's weird, but he's an, oh, he took a mon, oh, he picked monumentality second, mm. is it okay to have monumentality second, if, if he goes this way, that he must build, like, a couple of more cities, he's about to build one, maybe he can have a few more cities over here, but if he's not going to build extra cities, that's weird, but, isn't it, isn't it like a common thing now to go for a uh, Pembrushian voice, right? FKDN, Daniel, playing Korea, has 107 
uh, science, 40 culture, and uh, unfortunately, like Boris has only seven cities with a 51 pop, same as America by this time. That's weird, super weird for a uh, for a uh, Khmer. Six thirty six for Daniel on Korea. Six forty for JJJ Age of Steam Victory. He's fighting Hungary for entire game. And 68-59, yeah, that's quite bad, that's quite bad, Hungary has better stats, more military, more production, even 178, 187, and uh, 137 only for Age of Steam Victoria. It does look like Age of Steam Victoria is not that strong because of the lower tempo, or maybe he was just unlucky having Hungary as a neighbor, and he couldn't, and he couldn't build uh, all the districts or... All the builders he'd like to. But, you know, stats are not the great. 76, 57, 91, 45 for Sandro, who's playing Age of Empire Ricky. Uh, and only 112 production, that's a disaster, I'd say. And 6 cities, 39 pops. Very bad amount of pops. Like 36, 39. Here is Vietnam having 41, but it's the war. Okay, and Vietnam has 29. I, I'd like to. I, I just wanted to say that it's the worst number, but Vietnam has 29, and we'll have even less because England is about to wreck Uber Eat. Well, he does have some pre builds but England has a uh, Sidok. It will help him a lot. A level one. Level one Caravillas. That might help. For a moment I thought uh, he was going for Victor 3. But he wasn't. Look at this damage. And no Admiral on this side. But luckily for Dima he does have plus 5 from Twilight Valor. He should have. Can check it right now. Yeah, I guess that's plus five for melee for all melee uh plus five combat for all melee attacks. Yeah, I think Twilight Valor is on. Um he barely can push and it's uh, quite hard to push here. No. So he's set for uh, at least uh, 20 more turns, or maybe till Korea reach uh, Iron Clots. But with 108 science, it take him a bit longer. As we might hope. Oh, he's going for universities. Nice. Turn 57. It's quite fast. It's really popular to go early universities. Uh, America definitely has, has them. Now he's going for now. So, universities before turn 60. Uh -huh. Oh no, look at this. They pushed through, they can now control the path. England wasn't ready at all. Uh, definitely can't lose a city because of uh, Caravilles. But he doesn't have any other units, so... He's about to lose some tiles to a pillagers. Swordsman, of course, can try to beat this guy, but look at them. They have, like, full plate armor uh, with a weird helmet, but okay. Maybe it's not a full plate armor, maybe it's just a chain mail with a nice shoulders and uh, glows, metal glows. Yeah, it looks, it looks like a shoulders and metal glows, but no. Uh, no plate armor on, on their chest, so it's chain mail. But still, look at this. These guys are absolutely naked compared to those. Poor helmet, poor chain mails. Maybe it's not even chain mails, maybe it's uh, uh, not lamellar, but how it's called. Uh, brigandine, I guess. I don't know how it's called in English. The, the, the jacket with the metal plates, with the small metal plates on it. And this hammer will just kill those guys like one hit in the head and you're dead. 
I can't even handle this. Oh yeah, 65, 46. Oh, maybe it will be better with the general. It could be better with the general and the fortified defense, but... I believe I lose the capital. Things are not going good for a one last ride. Things are not going good for one last ride. I have more gold, right? 100, 200, 320, right? Even more. It's even more than 3, 3, 330. Here, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, they have an equal amount of gold. Coastal team has an equal amount of gold. But I'm still boring about America. Look at this, 291 and... There definitely we might see some Mustangs in a in a 30 turns, maybe in a 40 turns. It depends on the signs. Okay, frigates. Frigates are coming from the other side. Still no improvements. No improvements on trials. We need those. Nah. Uh, Hungary still can't push through. But maybe it can actually. Uh, where is England here? In a text, it's printing. It's light cavalry and the crossbowmen. Good amount of units. Remove sides. Uh, Bradford still holds. But the crossbowmen are getting XP. They're getting XP. You can't hold here forever. Oh, this guy's quite strong. It's left or right, right? No, it's 7 and 5. Okay. 7 and 5. Looks like GG. N no, it's too early. Oh, suit of armor. Oh, thanks. Su suit of armor. Thanks. Thanks, Linda. Well. Anyway, these guys are super strong. Well, that looks brutal. Look at them. Um, I used to play in a 2D mod for uh, most of the time, but when I started casting the games, uh, I, I really appreciate how these units are done. I really, I don't know how can people be uh, disappointed in Civ 6 graphics. Look at this. Look at this. Why it's so if 5 has better graphic, no it's not, no it's not. Oh, okay, he's about to raid Korea. Oh, he's raiding Korea with the scout already. Uh, doesn't even need to upgrade, but he can because they have a lot of gold. Like, he can upgrade all these horses for the, what, with one turn. It's, uh, what, uh, 65 gold? 125, 60, 63 gold for upgrade, right? The Black Army, 63 gold. Or it's 125 already with the policy card. Uh, let's check it. It shouldn't be that expensive. No, no, it's 63 gold. 63 gold to upgrade. And he's going to pillage everything here. If he pillage everything in Korea's side, mm. that get even worse. That get even worse. I think for for me, Yank is winning this game hardly. But now thanks to America, of course, Roy's doing a great job here. Look at this yields three hundreds. Nice, best science, best science. Even with the and the best culture, right? Yeah, here has better culture. And Khmer has... Okay, maybe Buddhists can carry somehow. It's still an option to achieve cultural victory here with the, with the Khmer, but... Um, yeah, I think it's it's good one. I think it's a good idea. They have they still have a victory condition here on the Khmer. And I believe America can easily counter it with the film studios. 
but maybe he'll be busy fighting and maybe they expect that he's he's going to irrel himself but it's like a free units with a plus five free units with a plus five how can you irrel yourself with that oh yeah they can't push farther uh sit dogs are here and to the north we have naval fight a lot of activities oh data has to f defend Bahwar Bahwapura. oh no he got it he got a frigate with a sea dog oh unfortunate just demon is just unlucky yeah, I thought he'll settle here, maybe here. Okay, he will settle here, on the lake. He's like, nah, I'm good with this city. And it's because of a chocolate. Oh, he's slowly, he's slowly looting this, his ground. Well, his sea, his water. <laughs> what the hell is Khmer GPT? What? 144? Oh wait, uh, my bad. He's not defending him. He's taking his city because they're enemies. Ah. What a surprise. So he went for, not for culture, but for GPT because he went for a second or third market. Commercial hub district, and he's trading with uh, with Korea. Maybe he was trading with England. Ah, oh, look at this. What the hell is this? Yeah, it's uh, yeah. He's trading with England. Rival, rival, poor Bristol. The tricky one, and England trade, trades with him. That is why they have a good amount of GPT. And when you have these naval trade roads, you definitely should go for it. And he's having only he's got only one naval city. Well he had only one naval city and now he has two, but not for long. And it's the only port city in his empire, and he'll get all the traders moved through it, and it's an arena city, extra gold for him. That that is that's a good amount of gold. Rain engineer is a good amount of gold. I really like Rain in the gold terms. But unfortunately gold is not the only thing you need in the game. Like in real life. Well actually no, we have a good um, property institutes and uh, you, can, you can own your gold. Previously you have to spend some gold on on protection. Oh, well, still have to. Hmm. Maybe Nothing changed for the last couple of thousand years. Yeah, I guess nothing much changed since, uh, I don't know, since nearly. The biggest problem here that Mitla is the only one blue city state, and we all know where will it leads you. It will lead you for a nuclear domination <laughs> victory. Ah, oh, he's upgraded. He have upgraded. One, two, three, four. Oh, is he about to hit? No, no, it's diplomatic. Only now. Oh, classical. You know what? We've we've done a full circle. We've done a full circle. When the game was released, there was nothing much to do, and you just chopped everything for a horseman it was horseman rushed then it was there was no coursers it was horsemans and cavalry and then helicopters so the game was about uh, to reach cavalry as soon as possible and upgrade it and you know what after six years of gaming we're back to the source <laughs> you have to rush uh cavalry <laughs> and, and and that's it that is that is what hungary do He's about to eat cavalry and will pillage entire Korean continent, entire Korean countryside, civilization, whatever you can call it, whatever. Oh, whoa, 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 Dido can, could push? How could that be? How could he push? 
That shouldn't happen. Uh, with the help of, with the help of, I believe, with the help of a frigates. Korea has its own frigates. Jack, what? Yeah, Jack, because Jackus. Well, he... Um, look, he likes playing Hungary. Hungary has a really good Pearl of Danube seeming bonus. It's a Giga Chat bonus because it boosts not only districts but building can add. So you can have very cheap campuses, very cheap commercial hubs, and when you have campus, when you have campus and commercial hub magnus and channels, you'll eventually get good amount of production, good amount of tiles improved, tall cities. Uh, well, well, not tall cities now because it's um, Magnus because Magnus was revoked, but still, and a good amount of starts. So, he did great. Oh, by the way, uh, let's check his commercials. Yeah, he used policy code. Same as Sandra here, right? He was buffing campus, I guess. Oh, ah oh, no, he he built this to have extra city on that was it side. Oh, data fleet is about to be over. Oh, retreat, retreat, tactical retreat, guys. But even more sea dogs are available. And look at this, America could push through a pillage some tiles, and he's right on the walls of capital of the. Hello, Liverpool. Oh, even more units from Ayutthaya levied by Hungary. Oh no, such an annoying thief. Such an annoying thing. No wonder everyone hates it. I just hate to play against it and it's eventually banned. But you can't ban everything. We have a lot of strong thief that can be annoying. Maybe not like Hungary, but still they can be strong. So we have, we have raid here. We're about to see a raid on Korea. After they upgrade military, uh, after they discover military science and upgrade those cavalry, um, elephants and trebuchets are here. They probably can't do much because of the sea dog spot. On the other hand, uh, Chesdim was able to destroy. He was he raised the city of Khmer, and he's pushing England back. So Ugar is still alive. How can he survive for that long? That is a perfect game for perfect game for just Dima. He was in a quite difficult situation because of Korea and England, but thanks to America, seem he's he seems fine. He seems fine. I don't know. He's about to lose every single unit, and America is going for industrialization, and and we might see even more men at arms or even or even uh, musket men's. So you know what? Uh, in Atsu Five, Lincoln had a Musketman unique unit. Uh, I think it was cheaper to buy or something. I just can't remember. But here, Lincoln has a lot of uh, Musketman type units, and it can be even Musketman if you rush um, military science first. So yeah, Lincoln is quite uh, strong here. Awesome, and it's plus five. It's the the biggest thing is plus five. Oh, he has plus three movement. No, no spy for Sander, or he. Yeah, he has one. Oh, it's Khmer. Huh. I have no spy. And it looks like he skipped. Uh... Hey, it's Audience Chamber, so no spy for him. Like for now. Okay, first hit. You know what? Maybe he can do it? Hmm. So middle student was wrong? How can middle student be wrong? You should be able to defend your cities with the with the frigates. Maybe not against American men at arms. You know what? That is what could happen with England if Vikings could hold in a Newfoundland. I think it was Newfoundland. Well, they had some settlers, settlers, settlements in the, in the North America. 
like they sailed from Greenland to uh, North America. But they couldn't because they didn't have, uh, they didn't have uh, powder, so eventually they died, maybe from diseases, maybe from climate change, who knows. But if they could hold there, that would that that how American invasion could could look on a on a British islands. Uh, maybe if they could survive, they wouldn't lose the British islands later. England is literally uh, defending four versus one. Uh, which England? <laughs> Every enemy at Sif is pushing him. Uh, well, yeah, like one, two, uh, three. Only three. <laughs> Only three. Oh, yeah, it's Hungary as well here too. Yeah, you're right. Sandro, you're right. Subscribe, like, bell. <laughs> yeah, thanks, thanks, Kinex. Yes, you're right. Uh, I forgot about this Levit Curse from uh, Ayutthaya. Great thing. Great thing to have. Oh, James of St. George here. Thunder for everyone, absolute chat. Yeah, like uh, it's a typical game for Sandra. Yeah, it's a typical game for Sandra. You have to carry. <laughs> you have to carry. Well, I believe in the Buris, but if England fall. And it looks like he's about to fall because walls can't hold any longer. Look at this. It's 50 against 54. It's out. And there's a road here. Oh, maybe they had Bodica or maybe they just built one. Yeah, walls down. Walls down. And that means many times will just destroy. It's major victory. It's major victory for them. They will destroy capital. Uh, can they hold it? Uh, I'm not sure because England fleet... Oh, English fleet is blocked here. It's the price of a Khmer city. It was a bite. They loot them here. And now it's gone. And uh, to be honest, Leif Erikson is blocked as well. Uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, there's only one city here. It's Ugarit. And he can't push. He can't push England. And England will eventually rebuild. But, but it's a big uh, victory for America if he can just raise uh this he can't trace city but he can delete uh, Grand plaza it's it's a big hit maybe he can even destroy leads yeah i believe they can destroy leads whilst one turn okay maybe they, maybe they are they are not able to do so oh i hear upgrades it's 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 a it's a cavalry it's hussars i forgot that it's a hussars oh dear god You know what? You're playing. You're playing as uh, Korea. You're playing as Korea. Like oh, I have to improve something here, something there. Like fighting here, and you hear from the from your left side, like twenty units just upgraded, and you know you're fucked. It's it's not happened yet, but you already know you're doomed. You can't hold those hussars because they are extremely strong. And we should check how many mm, uh, city states. Uh, it's, it's Jack. Jack holds. Uh, pom, 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 pom. One, two. So it's plus four. And maybe he can have three. Uh, have he finished Kilva? He was building one. Oh, no, he couldn't. He lost it, right? Yeah, and he went for a library. Okay, he lost Kilva. Ooh, lucky, lucky. Lucky guys. Yep. Singapore is pocket. Uh, is he no? Is he aware? Is he aware about it? Oh, I know. Know that there's city state. Yeah. Well, he can. He can. Uh, I hope he was talking about the Jack po pocket city state. Maybe he can levy these units also later, or maybe he can choose this city-state. 
So he would have plus six. Uh, am I right? Sirs have plus two, or was they nerfed? Ah, it's plus one. Yeah, they were they were nerfed. Or maybe you need uh, some government type specific government type? No, no. I think they were nerfed. Only plus one for city state. Easy peasy. Uh, I don't know. They're always making some minor... But look, he controls two city-states, right? And he has plus two from city-states, so it's plus one, obviously. Maybe he controls only one, but... Uh, Jack one. Oh, I can see the chat, sorry. Oh, no, he controls one. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought he controls two, but no, it's only one. My bad, my bad. It's plus two, it's plus two, sorry. And I thought it was... was I, I thought he had two city-states. No way, GG. Oh, you have no faith. You have no faith in Boris. Oh, the guy having plus 14 against... Oh, it's GG. Oh! Okay. Yeah. Though its face may change throughout... Quite good game. Quite good game. And a quite fast. Okay, let's go in a... Post game one. If someone joins, it will be nice. If not, it will be even better. Because we won't have to uh, sit here for <laughs> half an hour extra. Yeah, they know they fucked. Like Sandra, uh, Thunder, maybe. Oh, Thunder will lose city next turn. Capital Korea is about to be uh, plundered by Hungary. So. No chances, no chance. And, 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 Dido had a great game. He did, oh, couldn't hold these guys, he lost some units, but it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. Even with an iron clot, uh, England capital is about to fall. Okay, let's wait for a couple of, couple more minutes. It's like, what, 11, 20? Uh, I don't want to wait for long. I wait about two minutes. Two, maybe three minutes. I don't want to wait for a Strike five minutes. So what can I say? Jake did Jake won again uh, with the ancestral hall with the Hungary legs. By the way, he was playing ancestral hall for Hungary for a long time because it is super cool to have a lot of cities with Hungary. Pearl of Danube gives you a lot of everything. It's a it's one of the best uh, bonus. It's one of the best bonuses in the game. Very strong. Nerf Pearl of Danube. Right? Привет, Katschik. Hello. Vitaius Peremoha. Oh, no, no. It was quite good, Kwan. Oh, did Dido had a great game, I guess. I thought you would die. It's just my average game. Yeah, I thought you would die, but somehow you was able to reach Carville some time and you haven't died from England. Uh, abuse with that Francis Drake. Or yeah, that's... Susie. I, thought... I don't know, it's a yeah. shit spawn, no two yeah. tiles, uh, how to play Hello. Yeah, uh, Green Hills only. <laughs> oh, I re really, re I'm really uh, impressed how I was, you uh, survived. I was having only two tiles to with two, two, I don't know. Yeah, yeah but... I, but... I'm improved... Uh, Silk and uh -huh. uh, fish and then and, and, uh, better, but I don't know yeah. what the fuck this spawn. Well, stun circles helped a bit, but yeah, only green hills really hard to play. But still, still we survived. And uh, somehow you could uh, destroy Khmer City. Oh, that was nice. That was oh, nice. Guys, Korea was not prepared at all. <laughs> Yeah, he has nothing. He has no units here. Like he's fighting, he's fighting like on a seventh naval fight, and somewhere from the left, he has like twenty units just upgraded. 
and he knew he fucked by that time, so. And he almost took uh, Sunder City, so, yeah. Well played, well played. Uh, did you have any uh, funny moments that I might miss? By the way, Jack, you did a great job by delaying England City early in the game. Like with a couple of scouts. Mm. Yeah, that was the plan. When when nerf Hungary, Jack? Why it's so strong? Why why don't see anyone else playing Hungary then? I don't know. Maybe they don't know about Pearl of Danube they, they, or they, something. They, no, I play Hungary every single game. <laughs> Nobody wants to ban it. Oh, even though even though every even though uh, I feel like everyone who play against me know I'm like one trick uh, Hungary abuser. I I literally play Hungary every game when it's not uh, banned. Yeah, but usually it's banned. On, on you know? <laughs> it's usually it's banned. No, that's not true. People don't yeah. ban it. Oh, people so... don't. Uh, people don't uh, don't ban it and don't it's respect. It's a gamble of thief in seven seas. I don't think it's a gamble thief. I mean, on this uh, map we had, besides Dida, we had uh, good spawns, but in the previous map, I think your spawn was. I mean, uh, not I that mean, good. it was. It was. Awkward, but would be shit for any save, not just for Hungary. And yeah, but... I mean, I, ha I had three cities on the river. Like, I already have some tempo. I have extra plaza uh, production. I have commercial production. That's more than I need. But it is one of the tips that never wants to build harbors, on, and it is crucial on seven seas. But if you spawn on land, yeah, it is but, very strong. But at the same time, since everyone goes harbor, you get. Merchants yeah, for free. True, true. I don't think it's like gamble as money it's or bit. Portugal. It's yeah. a bit gamble. Like a bit gamble. You might have bad spawn, but if you have average spawn, it's still they're still in elite in advance. I think you can go compasses if you don't have rivers, and you can play for like a cross fast crossbow timing on somebody, oh, yeah. and then you can really uh, screw somebody out of the game. With that. Yeah. Uh, men at arms or crossbows or something else. Uh, why only one city state, Jack? Have you lost some invoice? No, what do you mean? I have uh, I have Mitle and Ayodhaya, he tied me. Ah, okay. Yeah, because I was checking and I thought he, that they he beat me to kill the, He beat me to ah. kill the, so he managed to control mm -hmm. it for now, but I think I will take it back in a few turns. Would you like to sue Singapore? To uh, I wanted the, <laughs> the position of Ayodhai is much better because okay. I can use units. I mean, I had a decision between trying to choose like three or four uh, less relevant city states or mm -hmm. I try to go for Ayodhya because I could choose Singapore, I could choose Laventa for units, I could choose yes. uh, Antanariva for units. They all had, uh, they had, all had no suzerain, so I can actually choose them all. But I kind of uh, decided that denying I tried to Khmer plus putting pressure on England is probably more important. Yeah, I have a question about that, uh, Jandre Chola. Is it better now with the, the privateer core than it was before with uh, when you, everyone rushed? I mean, Chola. I think it's only cancer on England, no? Mm, well, I, I, I don't know. It. It's the first time I saw this. Sea Dog has higher strength uh -huh. than the privateer, and England obviously captures units, so it's like extremely annoying to deal with. But I don't know, I think Rajendra was a lot more cancerous before. Yeah, mostly because everyone was chopping on that and even skipping. Uh... I mean, it's because uh, like uh, the the positioning uh, can just decide who gets uh -huh. a random combat bonus for the rest of the game. Like how how stupid is it? For example, you somebody has enough early game production to do projects and not uh, and uh, and have navy, while other guy doesn't. And uh, the guy who has better early game also gets a plus three combos for no reason over you, and then you have to deal with that. Yeah, it's getting even worse. No production, no chola, and no fights. You're right. Yeah. I don't know, it was quite solid victory. For a moment I thought that uh, Tido will die, but once he hold, it was kind of easy peasy for you after after he survived. I mean, he just needs to... He's just forcing uh, Korea to commit to naval while mm -hmm. the Hussars are gonna... I mean, I don't know if I fully kill him, but I will for sure pillage uh, so much yields that 
then I can feed the gold to Lincoln, and I think this is just key. Has Lincoln need any gold? He had like I more mean, than three hundred I mean, production I earlier. I, I mean, I, I mean, this England is Iral, right? Yeah. And uh, Kerry is Iral, and another England is also yep, Iral, yep. and uh, only Khmer good. means we have two, two, two guys, three same versus one guy, yeah. and uh, yeah, I think we're he's in a better spot. Uh, I'm curious, is Vietnam aiming for uh, Chichenitsa? I don't know, I don't know what he's doing. But, uh, because he had like quite few production and uh, long gameplay and no tiles chopped or like improved. So maybe, I, I was thinking maybe he was aiming for uh, Chichenitsa. Is he here? Ah, no. he left, everyone left already. Okay, Jack, yeah, I won't hold you. I, I won't hold you, so GG, we'll play it GG. once again. Perfect Hungary, you play it again, again, wow, again. The same, played, the same I... game style, same I mean, game it's style. not my fault, people <laughs> don't respect Bennett, you know, like people know I like Hungary and I play it on every map and then people like don't want to respect Bennett, so I just keep playing, you know? You do the same thing every single time, four cities, uh... Then uh, Ancestral, then 12 cities, boom, 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 fast district I mean, with a uh, Pearl it's, of Danube. Yeah, good. I mean, it has, <laughs> it has sort of a uh, similar play style, yeah, but yeah. at the same time, I feel like every game is unique because you well, play with the yeah, city sure. states and uh, your your timing, you know, the way you play it is kind of de depends around the city state. I think it's interesting because you get... Uh, the, the sim and the war at the same time, which is not uh, something a lot of save can do. So you like you, you get you get the benefits of having action and uh, not and staying relevant in the game. Yeah. So you think? Uh, okay. One more question. Uh, you think uh, Abraham Lincoln is great? Because no, nothing might know. change I'd... it. Nothing might change it. Like a like People extra twenty production. Just because yeah, it's yeah. not because it's like twenty production. It was okay before. I don't know why people hate him. It's like a free unit. No, it wasn't okay spy. before because you had uh, your your industrial zones were shit. Now they're guaranteed to be good. So well, well yes, but it's only extra twenty production spent on Aqueduct, isn't it? It's it's double production towards Aqueduct. Well, huh? okay, double production. Like what? Okay, how much was it cost before? Like 50, 60 production for an Aqueduct, I mean, and now it's thirty. In. We can load in into Lincoln and see how much his Aqueduct cost. Oh, okay. How much production he's okay, saving? Okay. But like, I think it's about twenty production save, maybe thirty, but not more because Aqueduct is cheaper. It's, it's like per uh, city. Yeah, it's per city, it's worth it. And then you also well, get, it's, it's the you same. Get the amenity. I mean, you get amenity. Is, the amenity uh, is the is the same. So all, yeah, only thing is change it. It's extra twenty production, yeah. And you still build Aqueducts after industrials, right? Not too big of a deal, maybe. I mean, I don't know how to give you a better example. Imagine yeah. you have, uh, I don't know, uh, Ferrari, but uh, your, you know, your your ties are squares instead of circles, right? And then you just okay, change okay. the, the, then you change only the tires from from square tires to a circle, and then it starts actually, you know, moving okay, quite okay, fast. Okay, and, okay, you, okay. and you can say, well, the the car is the same, but <laughs> yeah, you just only yeah. change the tires. Yeah, no, right? no, like, no, no, it, no, It's no. not much, but it's, it's not the way it works. Okay, okay, okay. It's like a wrong 320 production, or 30 production. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, it, it looks good. It looks really awesome. Roy, uh, I mean, what time is it? Up, his, you know. his, he Aqueduct in capital was 42, 42, 43. Oh, that's a lot. 68. That's a lot. It's so, 40 production save, right? 60 production No, save. half, half. He, so he gets 20, yeah, 20, 20, 20. No, he, if he spends, it, it's already with a bonus, right? Or it's... Uh, yeah, it's, it's before the bonus. Wait, it's... Uh, how the bonus sounds? 100% production, production, right? Oh, okay. okay, got it. So my bad, my bad. The only way you can have a reduced cost of the district is if you have a unique district. Even yeah, yeah, yeah. even even Japan, Japan doesn't have a half cost district. Japan has yeah, double, double production. Double production. Yeah, district. Yes. So any production number is listed as if it's a normal price. Uh -huh. and, uh, so the it's double saved half, applied. like 20, 30 production. So yeah, so it's like, I mean, not much, but like... It just makes industrial zone opening much better. And also you have to take into account that the main reason uh, Lincoln was also shit is because the matter was 
heavy Magnus and then people mm -hmm. started playing less Magnus now, right? So yeah. all the saves that didn't don't rely on traders just got better. Like... Yeah. Oh, uh, I missed. Was he opened with uh, Pingalet to rush industrials, right? Or he went for no, no, it seems he opened Magnus Lopsha. and he actually went traders. I don't know how he opened actually. Okay. I have no idea. I have no idea I... okay. how Roy played because I don't know, he didn't say well, much, he, and he... Uh, all I was asking uh, is uh, gold and horses. Okay, well, uh, I can tell you of... it was double campus opening, then I expect double... Uh, yeah, he did go double, double discount, campus. Double discount for everything he built after. I think. I understand why like he went Magnus, though. I think it's... It well, he, he got uh, very fast, he got really fast mark markets. I mean, I, 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 I feel like... Magnus traders are a bit too slow. You need to have a half cost district to justify because the, mm. the culture is uh, the, the the fact that you get got your moksha super late yeah, really screws your feudalism timing. Like for example, even I was struggling on a culture mm. as Hungary, and I have a pretty cheap commercials. So, so what do you think about uh, Pingala opening? Uh, to get like he went Magnus, faster, but faster. oh, but the, but the reason he went like this is. He had uh, Pantanal, so he was not behind on stats, mm. and with double double campus and everything, he actually had pretty good stats. Is my is 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 Lang promotion not working on Pantanal? Does he have no, a Lang promotion? No oh that, why? No. But it's like a swamp. Why not? I hope it will be two four. It's a really cool city. I, I hope. I was hoping he will do what he did, and he did it, and I was so happy about that. Okay. Thanks a lot, Jack, for uh, chatting and uh, uh, good night for you. I believe it's what it's one p.m. Uh, one a.m. already. No, oh no, it, it's, it's close midnight. to midnight. Okay. So good night. Bye bye. Maybe, maybe you know, maybe, maybe a commander sometime. <laughs> uh, we can, we can. I probably want to go eat right now. And okay. I... See you. Then we can play. I don't know, not today, but okay, okay, okay. Good, good night, good night. Bye, bye. So, guys, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, it was a quite good, good quality game. It wasn't that long. It was intense. A lot of actions, like here and there and everywhere. The Hungary with with the Korea with America and good sim for America. That's really, that's really strong sim now. With a buff, I think it's really awesome. And maybe Pingala is a good option. Maybe like have to play standard Moksha Pingala. It doesn't really matter uh, what you pick, but uh, Abraham Lincoln is now a tier S, I guess. No? Well, it's it's really good one. At least a tier A with a free units with a strong, uh, strong, uh, um, not many times, but uh, melee unit push. So uh, I hope. I don't know when we'll have extra games on the uh, safe Premier League. I can check it, but I believe there is no scheduled game for why uh, for near future. Yeah, there is no games for now. Maybe uh, we'll, they will add it later. Teams are just don't know when they can play. So I'll play. Uh, Age of Wonders tomorrow. I think we'll finish campaign, like third mission. I don't think there's more than three missions. Maybe it is, but I will play third mission tomorrow. And for now, I wish you good night. Sending you positive vibes, guys. There you go. Positive vibes and much love. Much love for you. Uh, good night. Bye bye. And uh, I hope I see you tomorrow.